As horse and pet owners, the 5th of November is a date that we approach with trepidation. Fireworks and animals can be a difficult combination to manage. However, as bonfire night approaches, you can take steps to minimize the impact they may have on your horse or pony. Check out the dates, times and locations of local fireworks events. Remember that people use fireworks to mark other occasions, such as New Year or a wedding. So watch out for public notices at other times of the year. Most neighbours will be kind enough to alert you to displays if you explain early that they can spook horses. Consider stabling your horse if displays are local. However, if your horse is used to living out, then he may be best kept in his normal field. Bear in mind that fireworks may not be limited to a single night. In many cases, they may be happening over several evenings. Horses are creatures of habit, so sudden changes to routine can be stressful for them. So don't unexpectedly bring him in if he usually lives out. Start stabling him a week or so ahead of the display to get him used to being inside. Bringing him in for a few hours, covering either side of when the firework displays will be on, is often enough. Keeping lights and the radio on along with the horse licks to distract him can help. But again, make sure he is used to these changes by introducing them gradually. The chances of a fire are low. But making sure you have fire extinguishers, sand and water nearby is a good idea, regardless of the time of year. Making sure that everyone on site knows the drill in case of a fire should also be part of the plan. On the night, staying calm is essential. Remember to limit the risks to your horse by ensuring there are no items near him that could cause injury, either in the stable or the field. However, if he does become upset, please keep yourself at a safe distance, out of harm's way. You cannot help him if you become injured. Use distractions. A horse licks is a great distraction at any time, so make sure he has access to his favourite colour. Provide plenty of hay to keep him occupied, even if he is in a field. If stabled, a radio can help to mask the noise of the fireworks, but make sure that it is out of reach and get him used to the noise. Closing the top door and keeping the lights on inside the stable can help to reduce the effect of the flashes from the fireworks. If you are worried, then check your horse regularly during the evening. Staying with them on the yard may even have a calming effect, but remember to stay safe. Remember, if he does get stressed, it's important that you stay safe so you can help him once the fireworks are over. Carry on daily checks. It's best to carry on with your horse's normal routine, but remember to check thoroughly for any cuts or injuries which might be easily missed in the dark. Time for a field walk. Check your entire field, including water troughs, hedges and trees, for stray fireworks that may have landed overnight and could be a risk to your horse. Quiet fireworks are now available, and these can still provide the wow factor without the bang. Why not make family and friends aware, and this will hopefully help to reduce stress and worry for our animals and ourselves. And please, stay safe everyone. <laughs>